I wanted to introduce my fourth pigeon. I don't talk about him a lot, but you might see him in the background of some of my videos. <laughs> Sorry, right now he's in this cage. Um, this is Mr. Emilio. Um, as you can see, he's dancing for us. And he's very handsome. Yes, you're very handsome. You're a handsome guy. Um, uh, right now he's just in this cage because I have Fluffernutter out and Fluffernutter wants one-on-one -on -one time. Yeah, you can hear Fluffernutter cooing on my shoulder. Um, and anyway, I probably won't have a lot of pictures or videos of Mr. Emilio because he is kind of a little bit more independent than my other birds. He is an ex-show bird. He is a Portuguese tumbler. Um, and then after that, he was used as a breeding bird in a loft for a long time. And he is just not used to being handled. Um, when I first got him, and um, I think got him in 2020, uh, he was pretty skittish. I couldn't even get close to his cage without him cowering in the corner, basically. Um, but I obviously have built up lots of trust with Mr. Emilio Man as time has gone on, so he is happy enough to dance for me. You're very handsome. You're such a handsome guy. Um, and he's also really smart. Uh, I've gotten him to be able to recall to me just a little bit. Uh, definitely not as much as my other birds. He's so handsome, look at him. Uh, but he's still very skittish of hands, and that is because show birds, usually, um, when they're put into the show cage, they're kind of just like grabbed and then put into the cage really roughly. And because he was probably a loft bird for a really long time, that's really the beginning of his life, the first couple of years, that's all he kind of known. He was only ever really grabbed and stuff, like, to be put into a small show cage. So obviously he doesn't like hands. I am working on it though, he's slowly warming up to me. Um, he's actually my partner's bird. And uh, my partner loves him very much and hangs out with him all the time. Um, and he's just a very handsome man. He's very funny. And he's also pretty tiny, too. It's kind of hard to tell, but he's, like, super tiny. You can kind of see my hand. He's super small. Yeah! Oh, you're so handsome. Um, and yeah, usually you'll see him in the background, like, prancing around sometimes. And some of my other videos. And yep, this is Mr. Emilio Man. <laughs> I think he's mad that Fluffernut is on top of his cage. Thank you, Mr. Emilio Man, for your time. You're very handsome. <laughs>